Is, is it most people have that option? Is it most people are on a TV show and they're working out three times a day with this camera crews chasing them around and they're eating kale and strawberries all day long, you know, so they can lose a bunch of weight? We, we all live in the real world. And so the real world answer is, what is it that you can do so that you can continue to be successful, continue to see results, not get hurt, and have this be part of your lifestyle, right? So, so but for some folks, they're willing to commit to that hour plus P90X workout or P90X2 workout because their lifestyle, their situation, regardless of, 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 of other people's situations, that's what they can do. Other folks, they don't have the time, they don't like exercise, but they understand they have to be healthy, they need to be fit, so they buy a 10-minute trainer. And they'll do it 10 minutes because that beats the living crap out of zero minutes, which is probably what they were doing before. So you go from zero minutes to 10 and hopefully 20 and then maybe 30 and then maybe you're ready for Power 90 or one of the other beach body products. That's the whole idea. Each and every one of us has to make choices based on who we are, who we are, how many kids, how much work, how much stress, how much traffic, what your buyer rooms are, whether you live at altitude or you live at sea level. There are so many variables here. And so the last, what happens so often is things become super popular. Super CrossFit becomes super popular. They get their own games, it's on ESPN, everybody's doing it. And so that's my next thing. I want to do this popular thing. But my back's jacked up, my knees are screwed up, my shoulder, I separated my shoulder, but it's popular, so I keep doing it. You know, uh, there are other products out there, I'm not going to say their name, but there are other ones that some of us aren't supposed to be doing. Some people aren't ready for P90X, you shouldn't be doing it. You should be doing Power 90. But because things are popular, sometimes we get caught up in the popularity of something, and then here we are, miserable, injured, not getting the results that we want. So, you know, if spinning is huge, and they got to go spinning class, and you just freaking hate it, don't do it because, because everybody else is. You know, same thing with yoga and Pilates. I beg you, you do yoga and Pilates more often because it truly is two things at one end of the spectrum that have everything to do with the amount of you, I, I believe. So, you want to work on your weaknesses as much as your strengths. But, you know, uh, eat healthy food and exercise as long as you can, five to seven days a week. Done.